Welcome to Medicine Woman Tarot. This is going to be a general reading for the sign of Virgo. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Father God, in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, I'm going to give a clear and accurate reading for the sign of Virgo. I've already pre-drawn some cards, and what came out was the Queen of Swords, followed by the Fool card, followed by the Queen of Coins. So by looking at these energies right here with the Queen of Swords, this is the energy of being on guard. She's trustworthy, she's truthful, but she also will not put up with any nonsense. The first sign of something that doesn't feel right with her, she will cut you off. The full card shows about taking a chance. And the queen of coins is financially stable. She's financially either taken care of or financially independent. But we will get some clarifiers. Why is the queen of swords here for Virgo? All right, we got bad health and courtship. So this could possibly be what perhaps jaded you. Something about a courtship and bad health. Why, what happened between this courtship and bad health? Okay, message and thief. All right, Virgo, from what I'm seeing here with these energies is you possibly even could have been going through a difficult time where you weren't feeling well. You know, you possibly could have been sick. And with the thief card, it shows that someone stole from you. What is the full card here for Virgo? Concern. Something about taking a chance is causing you concern. What's causing Virgo concern? Poverty. You're worried about your finances. You're worried about being in poverty. What is the queen of coins here? Main male. Okay. Toil and labor. Okay. There could be a male in your life, Virgo, that wants to take care of you is what I'm picking up here. And you were hurt in the past from what I'm seeing with these energies, Virgo, and you're afraid of taking a chance with this individual. You're afraid, and this male is going through a lot of toil and labor to try to, from getting, be involved with you. Tell me more about this main male for Virgo. Lovers. Yeah, this person wants to be your lover. They want some type of uh, involvement with you, what I'm picking up here, Virgo. But we'll get some more clarifiers out. This person could be trying to be somehow romantically involved with you and you're kind of closing them out. Tell me about this main male that wants to be involved with Virgo. King of Coins. He is the counterpart to the Queen of Coins. So by looking at this right here, he wants to be involved with you. He's the counterpart, see, to the Queen of Coins. These are the match. All right. So once again, a lot of earth energy here. This individual possibly could be an earth energy, but take it how it resonates. It could just be the energy that they're in. The King of Coins is a loyal individual this is a person that's financially good with their money they're not very good with their emotions don't wear their heart on their sleeve but they are loyal tell me what will be the outcome between virgo and the king of coins should virgo let this person in their life what will be the outcome for virgo and this king of coins one card here for virgo and the king of coins Six of Cups, this could have been someone that you knew from your past. Seven of Coins shows working towards something. Hermit, you're in the Hermit energy, Virgo. You are keeping to yourself. You are trying to keep this person at a distance, and you're just doing self-reflection. Sorry about the dog sneezing in the back. All right, let's get some more cards out here. What will be the outcome between Virgo and this individual? All right, we have the Three of Cups, the social gatherings, parties, and the Knight of Cups. This person wants to offer you love. Knave of Cups again, offering of love. Knight of Cups to the Knave of Cups. This is all offerings of love. A lot of emotion. 
Ten of Cups. Yeah, this person wants to offer you the Ten of Cups, Virgo. This person wants to be your everything. This is like a soulmate energy because you're both a counterpart of each other with the King of Coins to the Queen of Coins. And with the Ten of Cups, they want to have the whole nine yards with you. They want to have the family, the stability, the loyalty, the marriage, the house, the home, the happy family life with you, Virgo. And from what I'm seeing here, even with your overall energy, you got the justice card. So you're weighing this person. You're weighing the options of this individual because you were hurt in the past by some someone that stole from you and took advantage of you. But Virgo, I see that this person actually really does love you. So it wouldn't hurt to give them a chance when I'm picking up here. You know, because in the past, yes, you were, you took a chance and it didn't work out. But what I'm seeing here with this energy, Virgo, is this person who's going to enter your life wants to take care of you and wants to be there for you. So perhaps, Virgo, it's worth taking the chance. I hope this resonates with you. And if it does, please like and subscribe.